good, wonderful, beautiful morning, audience. I have a feeling today's vlog is going to start out with this, and then it'll be the next day. <laughs> We are packed up and we are getting ready to leave the hotel. We are all exhausted, very exhausted, all of us. The guys are across, they're in the room across the hallway. They're getting their stuff ready. We waited to leave till today because it was snowing. There's the RV way out there. Jamie's going out there to load it up and hook up the Jeep and we're gonna head north and head on home. Memphis is like, no, I'm just gonna sleep. We're just gonna sleep. Yeah, that's what I would like to do. Can we just stay here and sleep all day? How about we drive three and a half hours and then sleep all day? But you get to sleep on the ride. What do you think of that? Deal? All right, deal. You ready to head out? You're just ready for everything. I can tell you're the young dog and you're like, no, nah, I'm napping for days. Kira was napping too, but now she's like, wait, something's happening? Don't leave me behind. That something is totally happening. Who put a timer on the camera? I'm blaming you. I don't think you could put a timer on video. Look at Greg's eating, and look at Kira's like, what's he, what's he got over there? You got snacks? Oh man, well, you got I snacks? Found a third friend. Is there snacks? Because we too like snacks. We're loaded up. Are you guys ready to head home? The dogs are like, yeah, we want to. You want to sleep in your own bed tonight? Say yes, please. Yes. You can't sleep in your own bed tonight because you ain't going home yet. Not yet. Sorry, you got a couple more days. Uh, hi, mom. <laughs> Your mom watches my vlogs. Hi, mom. <laughs> Look, I'm on, I'm on TV. <laughs> Are you ready? Let's you get this show watch vlogs on the road. On TV? <laughs> <laughs> it's bigger. Oh. <laughs> yeah. oh my goodness. Ready? Three, two, one, go! <laughs> hey, there's snow in our backyard. Not much, but there's snow back there. Hi, Miss Memphis. We made it home. Oh my gosh, you're the happiest puppers in the world! And there is. There was definitely snow. Quite a bit of it, from what I was told, but not much left. Yee-hoo! We at the mire! We did already go to one of these and bought stuff, but we didn't go to this one. I know, I'm saved up all my pennies for Widow's Weekend! Oh my gosh! <laughs> Everything's gonna be on sale! <laughs> <laughs> Also, is your whole town here? Yeah. By sure. the way, oh my gosh. <laughs> this is more people than I've ever seen and out in your town. There was a line at the post office. I know, wow, a queue <laughs> in your town. <laughs> this is the town stop sign. <laughs> Look at these like stretchers for your feet so you don't sink in the snow. These things are so cool. I want some for my house, but like, I don't know, like, I guess I could go, like, walk through the desert with them. Could. But they're, like, little stretchers for your feet. Have you used them? Yeah. Jamie and I had two really nice pairs for a long time. I've never seen any. They're very, very yeah. fancy. They're snowshoes. Not like the old wooden snowshoes. Those no, are, right. Like, the, the, like the tennis rackets on your yeah, feet. Yeah, exactly. To be from the Midwest, you have to own a coat like this. Wow, that's, that's too warm. That's what everybody wears. Everybody. That, that is way too warm. Yep. A lot of people you'll see in this color. Jamie had a black one. Greg's got a brown one. Imagine if I was a Midwesterner. Does, it, does, does that make you a real Midwesterner now? I'm hunting wadded. <laughs> no, deer, Dan. It's opening day for deer tomorrow. As soon as I can find my hands. <laughs> I think you're swimming in that. Am I Midwesterning? You are Midwesterning. Hey, tell me, because I know you all are from the side of the country. <laughs> Spitting image of your husband, right? <laughs> Off to go do a, a manly thing. Right, yep. That's the top of the axe. Yeah, is that what that is? <laughs> so, as it happens, we came back last night. We made some chicken noodle soup. You guys, you guys saw we went to Meyer, And now it's the next day. I still have, like, no voice from talking for three days. But I don't know if you can see behind me what's going on. Can you, can you see what's going on? Like, you guys can't see yourself. Hold on a second. Hold on. Can you see it? Can you see it on Memphis? Can you see that it's snowing? It's hard to tell when there's snow on you. I would show you the other two dogs, but they're like way back there. But can you see it? It's snowing. It is supposed to snow three to four inches today. Will it happen? We'll find out. So now it'll be just like the last time Dan came here. We should place the bets in the comments. Will his plane take off tomorrow morning? We will find out. Oh, and by the way, this isn't snow. This is just dog fluff. Usually when I come here, the salt pile is covered. Well, it's snowing. Wow, it's so cool. That's so big. Yeah, and we might get and we might get ice. What do they do? They're preparing for the world's largest tequila shot. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. it's so neat. It's so big, and it's all the salt that's gonna salt the roads. That's all the salt that's gonna salt the roads. But it's not edible salt. 
I mean, you could put it in your mouth, but I wouldn't. It's so cool. <laughs> and way bigger in person. Yeah, it's yeah. Well, look at the truck. You can see the truck next to it. Kind of gives you an idea of how big it actually right. is. Right. It's crashing behind us, but not here. We pulled up to see the water, the angry water. It's angry. It is pretty angry. It's a little bit angrier than you can see on the camera. Yeah. I mean, that's, those are pretty big swells. I would not want to be on a boat. No, oh. no, and I don't see anything out there. No. I don't see anything out there at all. That's what happens when it snows. Is it gonna get angry? Is that angry skies? Yeah, that's, that's the Lady Michigan. You can see, you can see the glass on the bottom under here. See it? Wow. Yeah, that's the glass bottom boat. And it looks at the wrecked boats. Yep, it looks boats. Like, yep, the shipwrecks out <laughs> in the, in the bay. No, it's not quite the view, it's just the parking lot. But. Yeah, yeah. Looks like they gotta do some repairs. She's got rubber falling off of her side. Well, that's pretty neat. And then they just they just shrink wrap it like the other boats for the winter? Uh, I don't know if she gets shrink wrapped or not. She looks like she needs some repairs, so they might do that before they before they shrink wrap her. A little bit. Well, that's neat. I know, I heard <laughs> I heard metal falling. Does that mean these things are falling down? There's a guy behind us working on a boat behind us. It's neat to they're see them out of the water. They're all out of the water. All for winter? Yep. Yeah, see, she's from Munising, Michigan. And then they brought her down here because they do glass bottom boat tours up there, but there's more boats up there. Oh, super cool. Oh. Bye boats, I'll see you next year. Yeah. Boat hibernation. <laughs> that one's called Freebird. <laughs> on the back, it's named Freebird. They all have some fun names. Oh, there's a sea wolf, that one I saw said sea wolf. I don't know what this one is. This one's sea is. eagle, because oh. sea wolf was taken. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you do have some cool things in your little town. Yep. And a trip to Alpena wouldn't be the same without nuggets <laughs> and nature. It's true. In that order. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Do you even know what's happening out here? Are you ready? Are you ready? Three, two, one. <gasps> Look at it! <laughs> I think it snowed. I don't think we're gonna get to three to four inches they're calling for, but uh, there's some snow on the ground, guys. Maybe just a, maybe just a little bit. Oh, it's, let's start, it's the snow that's gonna look all pretty in the trees. Okay, it's cold, I'm going back inside. All right, it's time for another snow check. The dogs are going outside. We're still playing the game of will Dan's flight leave tomorrow? Let's see what it looks like now that it's about 8.30 at night. Uh, remember how I said earlier I didn't think we were gonna get that three to four inches? I think we got like three inches. <laughs> Will Dan's flight leave tomorrow morning? Eh, I guess we'll find out tomorrow. <laughs> Dan's like... <laughs> I don't know if he's leaving tomorrow. I don't know. We'll find out. <laughs> Look it! We made it to the airport! So I'm not gonna let you guys wait. We're at least at the airport. Plane still hasn't taken off. What do you think, Dan? You're the cutest little airport. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I've never been skiing, but this makes me want to like go skiing. It is pretty cute. Uh, I'm I'm seasoned snow Dan now, gone to the snow dance. Yeah. And uh, this will I'll be fine through this. I might like <sighs> La Bamba through the sky a little bit, right. but I think uh, I think I'm gonna make it. And yeah. then I need a home alone through the airport to get uh, to the other plane so I could get to LA. So uh, well. Beautiful. I bring the snow to the yard every time I come here, do, it seems like. Do we want to risk it and have you end the vlog here, or should uh, should I wait and I'll end it at home I'm and update them? I'm confident that I am out of here right now, so thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, stay positive and dream big, and we'll see you again soon. Bye, audience! Boop!